It wasn't until I came to New York and I thought I'd walked into a scene from The Walking Dead. The, the epidemic hit me full square in the face. I just, I, I, I felt I needed to do something. I needed to be a part of, of the, the fight back. When my best friend got diagnosed, um, I really was overwhelmed and made some decisions that I needed to get help. And I did some discussions with people and found my way to Gods of We Deliver. It was Gangol by herself, you know, driving the, the force to feed people. I think sometimes we forget how strong that was in the beginning of, of God's Love We Deliver, that it was just about keeping people alive longer so that they could reserve their strength and not have to cook. I mean, this was a mission that all of us felt uh, we were fighting for other people's lives. And for me, it was a feeling like um, I was not affected, but I had to do something. It was uh, a mission. The freedom that fed the start of the 80s also fed the drive to take care of each other. That's the lesson of Stonewall, is care. Well, the first Pride I watched, I was on 29th by, by uh, Marble Collegiate, and I watched Pride come down. And as you got closer to 14th Street and all, I mean the roar. You, it's, you, can't, you cannot imagine it if you were not there. It was heart to heart. And it still is, hopefully. When I go to Pride now, I clap for every group that marches because I can't contain that spirit, that, that joy. It's, it's amazing, amazing. I think of God's love as being an integral part of the LGBT community because of the organization's roots. Here we are, for us, 34 years later, and we are still responding. But that's what we're best at, is doing whatever we need to do to respond to the urgent need. I'm so glad that God's love is still with us, I tell you right now. Um, it, it means a lot, you know. Food brings you love and brings you uh, a, a feeling of belonging and connecting, you know. It's just amazing to me. We treat people with dignity and love and respect and we provide an essential service in their health and their, hopefully their recovery. Um, food is medicine, food is love. It really is, it's really true.